It's been two whole years since I uploaded my first video on YouTube. A totally simple, super crappy guide on how to fix a Razer Blackshock V2X mic. I mean, I'm talking quality so low, you'd think I recorded it with a potato. I was still learning back then, but somehow, that video has over 193,000 views. Yes, apparently a lot of people are struggling with the same exact thing, which means today, wait for it, it's time for a redemption arc. So be sure to buckle up, my friend. Buckle up, Teddy. Alright people, we're kicking this off with the most important step, checking the mute button. If you're here because your mic isn't broken and then realize it's actually muted, listen bro, I won't judge. Just you know, go flip that switch button before we go full on mic surgery mode. Because sometimes life is just one mute button away from being a lot less complicated. Next, let's make sure Windows hasn't set your mic input to something random, like your mother's washing machine. <laughs> Head into your settings and make sure it's set to the right input. Usually Realtek or whatever matches your system driver. For me, it's plugged into my standalone mic, the Mono P200X, which by the way, happens to be going on a nice discount right now. Also try a mic test, use Windows voice recorder or hit up a mic test website. It's a quick check to make sure everything's sounding as sharp and working fine as it should. Now brace yourselves, because this is a big one. Thousands of users have reported that their mics magically started working right after ditching Synapse. And trust me, it'll save you a few great hours. Just go to the control panel and uninstall Synapse or the 7.1 surround sound from Razer and it should hopefully fix. I'm just going to show you a comment from Louis M 665 on a solution that helped him fix his mic and helped a few others as well. So pause this video and try it out to see if it helps you. Alright, if your mic still isn't cooperating, the driver could be the real culprit here. Do note that this could be a tedious process because you'll have to uninstall the driver and get it back again. First go to the control panel, click on hardware and sound and then manage audio device and check out recording tab. You can disable and enable your mic to see if it shakes things up. Then dive into the device manager, find the audio input and uninstall your mic's driver. Restart your PC, go back to the device manager and hit scan for hardware changes. If the driver doesn't come back, you may need to download it manually. I'll put a link in the description, so don't worry. If things are still not working for you, try plugging your headset into a different device. A PS4 controller, your phone, another PC, anything. If your mic still doesn't work, then it might be time to face reality. Your headset might be faulty, either hit up Razer for a replacement or if all else fails, treat yourself to a new one. And that's it. Now we're all set to hopefully get your Razer Blackshark V2X mic working like a charm. If this video saved your sanity, drop a like and maybe even hit the subscribe button for more guides that are, well, let's be honest, way more fun than they have any right to be. Thanks for watching and have an amazing day.